Well, guys, thanks for inviting for me show. to lunch or brunch or yeah, or just fruit. Welcome to. Fruit. Our Is this kitchen. real? We yeah, really, it's really, real. really fussed. Oh. Oh, you just did take a bite. I is, love it. Is that okay? Was it, yeah. is it good? It was really good. That was the one you shouldn't have taken a bite of, but it's is cool. It, is it washed? Do you want some Cheetos? No, we're cheese not puffs? in a washing. Is there Cheetos cheese puffs up there? Yeah, do you? I was making stuff at home. <laughs> There's some Oreos. They're the thin kind. You know, they're delicious. I like it. I'm yeah. just, I'm That's just put... some catnip. Oh, if well, a, If you have you a know. cat. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Um, so I want to ask you, because you guys are moms, I want to know which, which is worse, poop or puke? What's worse? Oh, jeez! Oh. You know what? That I just, I was gonna just say poop. I poop. But. I say poop because puke is not it, poop. Poop. Poop uh, made me uh, potty train my daughter much much sooner than I anticipated. Oh, no, there is a smell. Oh, that is you just it's not, because it's not on a regular basis. Sometimes when it is everywhere. puke, it's like. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Puke's not so as bad as puke. poop, but poop gets up in holes. No, but tell me about this, though. Riddle me this. There's nothing like a middle of the night, I don't know if you've experienced this yet, vomit into the bed where you're like, I am so tired, I can't believe I have to get up right now. It's gone through every layer down to the mattress, and you have to try to like re- Frickin' put a fitted sheet on a crib. But hold on one second. You can have have projectile diarrhea onto the same problem. What would you rather clean up? Ours, for some reason, that has never exploded out. It did in a tent once. We were camping. Oh, I had an explosion in a car seat? That is the worst. You can't beat that. It is the worst. When it's up the back? It's everywhere. But it's also if you're a baby girl, it goes in, in, you know. And so that's why I go with... It's a lot of folds. It's a lot of folds. So I say that vomit is is easier to clean, in my opinion, than than um, explosive diarrhea. We were on the hottest day of the You're season. welcome. We're what not going to let you. I'm this never is, having children. Honestly, never. this is a real hot topic for us. <laughs> never. we could go on and on. I am never having kids ever again. You just, I'm going to be just. What do you mean ever again? Do you have, I mean, no, you I, have. You're like, I have 19 and counting, and that's it. I think it's this weird fruit. I don't know what was in here. <laughs> I can't believe you took a bite. I mean, I hope it's edible. It looks like it looks like it's organic real. on it, it's right? It's real. Um, what kind of, when you, as your kids get older, what kind of parents do you think you're going to be? Are you going to be strict? Or are you going to be like the cool mom? What, what are you going to be? I don't think I'm ever going to be cool. I, and that, and that say is that such in like, a load of it. Look how cool she is. Yeah. yeah I mean, Super you seem pretty cool. damn cool. <laughs> She's the coolest. I, I hope that I'm somebody that my kids can trust. Past that, yeah. it, it really just, I don't care. I'm probably not going to be their best friend for a while, but I hope that when they're like in their 20s, we can find like a, a, you know, like I'm really close to my mom, like not on a mom daughter level. So I hope that one day I will be really like friends with my kids. But I don't, I don't come from the school of thought that my kid needs a friend at the age of eight. They, they have plenty of friends. I want to be my kid's mom. What are you, as they get older, are you to be the cool Absolutely. mom? Absolutely. I just want to be, I, I'm with Mila. Like if, if my, especially with my boy, my, my girl were already there, but if I want my, my son to feel like he can still tell me. Mm-hmm tell me anything i don't need to know everything but i just want him i want to feel like a safe Mm -hmm. open space for him to talk to like i i I could just see it like you can see it when they start to like you know he's nine and you can just see all of a sudden him starting to like just close off a little bit like which just happens and i'm like no 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 Uh uh-uh it's like we i want to make sure that we stay like connected connected um, who's your favorite TV? So to answer your question, yeah. the coolest mom. Oh, obvious. I mean, you guys are. Look at those bangs. I you mean, can't get cooler those than bangs this. are banging. It's a thick fringe. <laughs> a thick fringe. <laughs> it's my thick fringe. Um, favorite TV or movie mom, and why? Uh, Lucille Ball. Oh. Because I just grew up watching her, and I thought that she was funny and great, and. I think seeing someone be funny while being a mom to me, not that my mom was never funny, but it just wasn't her like thing that I was like, I hope I'm a funny mom. Like I just want to be a fun mom for my kid and Lucille Ball to me was very much that. God, that's a good question. I like Jean Kaczmarek and um, was she and Malcolm in the middle? Yeah. She's adorable. She's so good. She's great. Oh my God. Um, There's so many. Uh, Yeah, that's a really good question. I was gonna say Carol Brady because she just looked like she was just <laughs> on so many pills. pills. <laughs> she, she was, was just hot. like, it's all gonna work out. Because I've got Alice. Right. She was just stoned the whole time. Yeah, she okay. was just like flipping her <laughs> flipping her mullet. And everything was all blonde and taken care of. But final question, there's a lot of F bombs in the film. What's the you're swearing? How up? dare you? We're mothers. <laughs> The swearing in your house. What's what's this? What are you? Yeah, are you allowed to swear? Are you not? Are you, you have kids. 
We tried to stave it off as long as possible. Then the next stage was we had a bad word jar that, as my son pointed out, was mostly filled by daddy. <laughs> by daddy's bad words. And then, you know, it's, now it's kind of like no holds barred. Now they know that it's not okay, but we, I'm, I'm not, definitely not as careful as I was when I was a very young mom. Fuck but this, it's not like, that. no. I mean, my daughter heard me once say, oh, I'm going to have a fucking heart attack. And she was like, you're going to have a fucking heart attack? <laughs> and I was like, okay, so many things about that sentence that I have to contextualize for you right now. I'm not going to have a heart attack. And you should say fuck it. <laughs> like, it was like horrible. You just have to really watch it. Thank you guys. Oh God, on that note. Um, I smiled so much during this movie last night. Well, I hope you open mouth laughed. Oh 